Hello and welcome to another practical IT video. In this video, we are going to be taking a VM that I've created in VirtualBox and we're gonna back it up to my network attached storage. So I'm just going to pick this top one here under my second quarter 2020 uh, banner. And we're going to go to settings. And under storage, we are going to select the RescueZilla 64 bit ISO image. And we'll go ahead and start up our virtual machine, which should boot by default on the ISO image. And this will take just a moment, but again, the idea behind RescueZilla is to do one thing really well. And by continuing on the trajectory that the old redo backup and restore was trying to go down, I think they are accomplishing this very well. So when you first boot up RescueZilla, it is going to automatically launch into the RescueZilla wizard. So in this case today, we're going to select backup and it'll scan the drives. And this is the only virtual hard drive we've got. So we're going to say next and we want both partitions and we will say next and we want to back it up over the network. And so we are going to put in the IP address of the NAS. And the directory we want to save into and the credentials to log in. And we click next and we're going to browse and create a new folder and we're going to say vm backup demo and we want to save here next next and then we wait all right we have saved our 20 gigabyte virtual hard drive in 1.8 minutes and we can say OK and exit. And then we just shut down. And that takes us through the first part of the process. So in the next video, we are going to restore this image to a new virtual machine okay so that brings us to the end of another practical it video if you like the video please give a thumbs up please subscribe share with your friends and feel free to leave comments down below until the next video please take care of yourselves stay safe happy computing and have a great day